Oh, what's going on, everybody? See here, and welcome back to another solo Rust adventure in our first little our survival deal, if you will. Um, yeah, super excited to be back doing the things, doing stuff. And today we're building the greenhouse. We're gonna get our food supply figured out, and uh, yeah, we're gonna have a good time doing it. So hopefully you guys enjoy. If you do, like, subscribe, all the fun things. What I want to do is basically bring this out to here. And then I want to go ahead and let's get in a doorway. Actually, you know what? I want a door. I want to, I think I want a wall frame because we have, um, yeah, I want to, I kind of want like this. I want a nice big open area. You know what I'm saying? Um, and then obviously I want, I feel like we want windows all the way around because like what kind of greenhouse doesn't have windows all the way around. You know what I'm saying? Like, so we're going to do this and then this is going to be our greenhouse. Now, trying to decide so we need lights and all that fun stuff so we're gonna have to have like a regular uh floor kind of deal so let's actually get wall frames and because there is a stability thing so let's put these like if i put these like this will that support the floor you know what i'm saying i want to make sure that everything's supported nothing comes crashing down Okay, that looks pretty good. Yeah, that right there, that's gonna be our greenhouse. Okay, cool. So what do we actually need for, um, we're gonna leave everything else alone. I'm gonna leave it, we'll, we'll get it upgraded here in a second. Um, but what do we actually need for sprinklers and stuff? So if I go into crafting, if we go into like, what do we need for a sprinkler? We need, okay, so we need metal fragments. So we have a total of 75 of those. So let's build one of those. And then we're gonna need also, uh, small sprinkler space water around it requires a host connection to supply it with water okay so that doesn't that makes sense and then um a planter but we need an additional tarp we have the little one but we need a little one and then we also need actually we're gonna need a light as well uh this guy we're gonna need a ceiling light so let's go ahead and craft that before i forget i want to make sure that we have that and then we're also gonna need some kind of power stuff so ooh, what do i need for solar tech trash oh you know what Actually, I think, if I'm not mistaken, is this tech trash? Yes, it is. We've got the tech trash. Okay, so let's pop into here. Crafting. Let's get this guy. So power generation is 20. Um, those lights only require two, I believe. Um, so that's not bad. And then do we have a battery? We do have a battery. Okay, and what is that? Require high qual metal. Okay, so we probably should go ahead and get that. And then hold on. There's some. I'm sure there's. Well, actually, you know what? Let's pop in here. Let's look at the tech tree here. What is the the electrical stuff here? So what is this? Uh, a switch, battery. There's large solar. What is this? Combines two root electrical sources into a single signal, helpful for string, stringing together low energy batteries or solar panels to produce higher output. Splits an electrical signal into three multiple signals. The amount of it passes through. Okay, so we are gonna need this in order to go to multiple lights. Yeah, so we're gonna have to go ahead and unlock that and then we're gonna need to make a splitter. Okay, so use crafting. What do we need for splitter? One splitter, 100 metal fragments. Ooh, that's a lot. Let's go ahead and craft it. <laughs> I, I know I should probably be using my stuff elsewhere, but you know what, we're gonna figure it out. Okay, so there's that. Um, so we have a splitter, we have a light. Okay, so I think we're, oh wait, hold on. Is there a wiring tool? wire tool okay let's go ahead and craft that so that way we're good on that all right so we should be set on that we need to go out and find some tarps but we need to get some food we got to get our food figured out because we just don't have any food um i think we have to stay here in order to craft everything we need to craft <laughs> if i'm not mistaken okay so we've got everything let's pop up here let's get a drink let's see open capacity i should be able to go ahead and just drink from this and it has a lot in here Look at that. Okay, our water's maxed out, so we're good there. Um, Elmer 1 and Elmer 2 have disappeared once again. Um, I don't know. <laughs> Did they go to the other side again? I don't see him. Elmer's! <laughs> Where are you, Elmer's? They're gone. Okay. So that's fine. That's all fine and dandy. Okay, so let's do this. Now that we've got all this figured out, um, do we go ahead and... We probably should get up here and make ourselves a you know i'm actually <laughs> that works that absolutely works okay so let's do this let's get this guy and we'll place it uh like this and then i guess a battery and then from there we'll need some switching this must have to go on a wall okay 
So what we'll do from there. So this signal is going to need to go into, hold on, if we're going to do this. So that'll go into here. And then if we're going to have multiple rows, we're going to have to use, we're going to have to have multiple splitters. Uh, but I think we could, we could change the wiring later, right? Yeah, we should be able to change the wiring later. And then we're also going to need, um, we're going to need some splitters for some sprinklers and whatnots too. But actually, hold on. So light and sprinkler. We'll put our first one, uh, We'll put our first one like on this back corner right here. So we'll do, um, Ooh, I wonder how far the sprinklers reach. You know what? I wonder if this light, like if I can put, I wonder if I can put the light there and then the sprinkler there and then the plant is going to go in here. I think, I wonder if that light will do two of those. And if we need one sprinkler per, per deal. Okay. So we're going to figure that out, but we need tarps and we need a whole bunch of stuff. So let's go ahead and let's drop some stuff off. Let's go do some explorations and we need, we need to find, <laughs> we need to find more Elmers. Elmers, I know you're out there somewhere. You know what? We're actually going to need another storage crate. Um, can I actually, I can craft that, right? I can just craft. Oh, I need some metal fragments. All right, let me grab some metal frags and then crafting. I need you. So we'll go ahead and get another box set down in here as well. Perfect. Another box. And then we can go ahead and throw some tools in here because we have, we've already got a pick, so I'm not going to need that. We've got this. Um, should we go ahead and throw, let's throw our tools. Let's throw our build tools in here. That way I don't forget them anywhere. And then we'll go ahead and just throw, I guess, everything else in here. We'll take a torch with us. We'll take this. Are we getting any low grade for anything? Probably not. I think we're probably good. All right, let's head out. Let's go see if we can find some goodies. Um, we do need to get some, we got to get some food stat, but I think we'll be okay. We'll find some food up here. Hopefully we'll find an Elmer as well. Oh, look at this little vehicle. This one's actually not bad. And I mean, I'm al I'm alone, so like I have no I have no need for anything else. But it, I mean, it, actually, this one requires two pistons, two spark two spark plugs, and a block, a crankshaft or camshaft, and then two valves. Wow, it's kind of a cool little uh, cool little deal though. It's like a little hot rod. Oh, we got some delicious snacks. Look at that. Oh, our f our health is finally going back up. Oh man, that is so nice. Thank you, Mr. Uh, Candy Van. Oh look, our wonderful safe zone that we live next to. Huh, let's continue on, shall we? Looking for tarps. You know, we could probably buy tarps in there, but if I could just find some, that would be the most ideal. Also, have not found any horses yet. <laughs> I haven't found any elbers walking around, which is kind of unfortunate. <gasps> Ooh, what is that? A water pipe shotgun. Ooh, exciting. We actually have something to use those uh, those rounds with now. That's exciting. I mean, we only had like four of the rounds, but that's okay. Oh, is that a bow? A compound bow. Very nice. Now, you know what? Honestly, a bow is probably the way to go because uh, you can probably craft your own arrows. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So that is probably the smartest way to go. Now, I don't know what I need these gears for, but I'm going to go ahead and salvage the, some of the stuff here. I don't have no shoes on. That's unfortunate. Can't believe we haven't found shoes this whole time. You know, not not a bad haul of uh, some some recycled stuff. Not too bad at all. Oh my gosh. Okay, you know what? Maybe we need this. Maybe we need this one instead. This thing. Can I open this door? I mean, come on. Like, it's it's like a camper van. It's ready to go. What does it need? Oh, it needs the double everything too. Oh man, I have, I've got, let's see. I have two rods. I have two plugs. I have no pistons yet though. Man, that thing is so cool. <laughs> might have to do, we might have to do a little car shopping before we decide which one we really want. You know, if I had not set up my spot already, this spot right here is actually a great spot too. Right off this road, you got a little area right here. And it's, it's relatively flat. Um, and yeah, it's right next to like an actual road. That's, that's pretty cool. Oh, <gasps> I picked up a planter. <laughs> yes. Oh, uh, that's nice. I haven't picked up, haven't picked up any tarps though. Have I? No, no tarps. We picked up a planter. That's pretty cool. What is this? Uh, oh, this is airfield. Okay. Uh, there might be people here that want to kill me though. Hmm. Not positive. There's definitely a, a boar that wants to kill me. <laughs> Are there people in here though? I don't know that there is. Let's go, let's go take a peek in here, shall we? I don't see anybody in here. 
I also don't know that this is the best place for loot. That would be a cool vehicle to take. It would be so cool if you could take these kind of vehicles like this instead of like the, the scrap looking ones. Like also in addition to, you know, I would drive that thing everywhere, even though it's horrible on fuel, but you know, it is what it is. Oh, look at that. He's coming in here to get me. I knew it. We're going to open the door and see if there's anything in here. Ooh. Oh, never mind. Is he seriously coming after me? Like just walking on in. Yeah, man, just come on in. You're like, this is my airfield. What are you doing here, boy? <laughs> Sorry, guy. Is there even anything up in here? Like, what do we have? Nothing collectible, nothing collectible. Nothing, 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 no. There's, there's, what is the reason for coming up here? I don't know. Is there anything outside? No. Maybe sometimes there is, and I'm just unlucky. Well, I guess let's go check out these hangers. See, that's a cool truck too. Oh, I would love to take that truck. <gasps> what is this? Ooh, you know what? Should we just drop some of these? Let's just drop some of these car parts for now. We'll work on getting a car another day. It's not hard to find those parts anyways. What is this? Flashbang. Oh, that's cool. Is there anything in there? Nope. First hangers down. Oh, what's in here? Uh, hmm. <gasps> this one is super sick. I wish these were drivable. <laughs> I really do. All right, let's see. What do we have in here? Anything that we can take? Oh, this crate. Any other crates in here? Got one. Oh, look at that. We got a shirt. What is this thing? Large rechargeable battery. Must have a minimum charge of five seconds to discharge. Can be wide and serious. Charging rate is dependent on power and with the max. Must have a minimum charge of five seconds to discharge. That sounds really cool. We might have to uh, just take that. That's going to have to come on with us for sure. Do any other crates anywhere? I don't see anything. Oh, we got a recycler. Oh, fantastic. I love scrapping stuff. It is like, it's one of my favorite things to do. It's just so much fun to turn other like junk into useful stuff. It's so good. It's just so good. I wish other games would do that. Oh, look at it. Did we miss that one? Wait, I thought we already got these. Oh, do these seriously respawn that fast? Wait, hold on a second. If they respawn that fast, that means that they're the first hangar I went to would have the, the crates again too. Let's see this crate we never took all of the stuff out of it yep the crates respawn really fast holy moly you know honestly i don't know if you can build in landmarks but this would be a cool place to build a base too this would absolutely be an amazing place oh, what is this thing electrical branch this object allows you to branch power off from a main line by a set amount oh that's kind of neat i don't think i really need that right now but that's cool <gasps> oh a salvage sword and a diving tank that's cool. Uh, we're gonna have to salvage some stuff. Actually, you know what? I don't care about this floor. Let's take this. I'd rather have that than, uh, <laughs> than the stupid floor. That is super cool. Okay, so a diving tank. So hey, you know what? We might need that uh, one day because you know I would I wouldn't mind doing some water explorations. I know there's like a whole underwater lab and stuff that like that sounds super cool. So I wouldn't mind checking that out. Oh, look at this helicopter. It'd be cool if you could take this. Just untarp it and like, let's go. Oh, there's an underground entrance deal right there. That's cool. So, you know, I know this whole time we are, uh, I feel like that is something I'm supposed to be able to collect, but you know what? There's, there's nothing else up there. Um, this whole time I'm trying to find tarps here. I mean, we found a planter box, so we could get one planter box going, but then we also need to find seeds and stuff. So that might, it might be a thing that we just kind of have to, um, we might just kind of have to get the one planter box going for now. And then like, as we naturally come across tarps, then we can make more, you know, as we go along. So that might just be a thing that we'll have to do. Okay. Uh, I guess we'll head back with our planner box and then we'll see if we can't get it all wired up and hooked up. And then I will keep checking. We can keep checking for stuff on the way, on the way back. <gasps> oh, there's a scientist right there. I bet you he wants to shoot me. I don't want to shoot him. I don't want to use my bullets unless I have to. Oh, what the heck do we got going on over here? Hold on a second. This looks like, like a swamp. Oh, it is a swamp. That is so... Hold on. What's, what is all this tall stuff? Uh, those look like cattails. Oh, is there alligators over here? Oh, I bet you there is. This is cool. Oh, there's a bear right there. Can I harvest these? No. There's a swamp here. That is so neat. Oh, it's so scary looking too. I really don't want to go out in there. Wait, what is that? Oh, it's just a boar. It's just a boar walking around. Forget the alligators. It's a boar. Oh, look at this little van. Oh, and it only requires like 
one of everything. Fuel economy for the engine to run any full set of computer. Acceleration top speed fuel economy. <gasps> it's so cute. <laughs> it's so teeny. I like that better. Should we try to get this running? Uh, yes, we should. Hold on. So we're going to run back in here. We're, we're heading back towards our, our house. Things should have already somewhat respawned. So let me go ahead and throw some things into here. I don't think we're going to need this branch thing. So I'm going to go ahead and just basically throw what we don't need. Probably don't need a bear rug. Probably don't need this. Turn that on. Let's see if we can find, uh, let's see if we can find some parts. Let's get, let's see if we get this thing. Cause, cause we have uh, a little bit of low grade, not a lot, but there's, there's a lot of cars right here. So, and that only needs like one of each thing. We might be able to get a vehicular going. Oh, okay. The vehicles might not respawn this stuff as much as I was hoping. Okay. We got some spark plugs. Let's throw those in there. Hold on. This little teeny tiny van is just perfect. I think it's fantastic. And it only requires one of each thing. So that to me means it's going to have some fuel efficiency, right? Okay. So we've got those. So I just need one of everything else. Okay. All right. Well, we're going to find this. This is going to be cool. We're going to get a van and then we're going to go home and then we're going to plant something and it's going to be amazing. All right. We got some valves. I just need, we need a, uh, an engine, some pistons and a crank. Um, uh, I have the extra, see, I have these, you know what? Actually, let's do this. Let's drop some, let's drop this and let's drop that. I don't know if we're going to need extra, um, extra pieces. Like I'm guessing they have a durability and like, as you run it, they probably drop. So then you have to like replace things as you go. That's going to be my guess. I'm not hundred percent sure. But I feel like we can get this running. So we're home. I had to drop off. We have, we have just too many goodies here. We got too many things going for us. So I wanted to go ahead and just drop off all of this. Uh, we'll take some of this with us, but I don't think we're going to need anything else. I did pick up a, um, a salvage hammer. So that's kind of cool. And then let's see, I'll keep the mushrooms on us, but, and then I also picked up another solar panel and a fridge. So we'll get those placed at some point as well. So I have a crank and I have an engine. I don't have any pistons though. So we might have to try to find a piston and then I want to go ahead and get uh, the planters planted, but I want to go, Oh, it's about to be dark. Darn it. Well, darn, I guess we'll go to, uh, we'll go to the outpost and I want to see if I can find any seeds. Do I have any scrap with me? I don't have any scrap with me. Let me grab some scrap. Then we're going to, I'm going to see if I can find some seeds that I can buy somewhere, uh, to plant. Cause I feel like we need some kind of food. So let me just take this scrap with me and then we'll just take a, uh, let's take a torch and we'll be good. And I guess on the way there, I'll also stop and look at all the vehicles and see if I can find a set of pistons. <laughs> yeah. Set of pistons. All right. I'm grabbing all of the things just in case. Cause actually, you know what? We might just try to go and grab that little, Oh, look at this little guy. So this thing's on fire. This thing needs two of everything. <laughs> what are the odds that that thing has working headlights? <laughs> like just, I'm genuinely curious. I, it's probably a no go. Um, but it'd be nice. Perfect. Let's see if we can find some seeds for sale in here. Now where we might find seeds is we might actually be able to go into here. And cause I think we can use, see, this is where we're at. Um, but we can actually look and see what everything has for what everybody has for sale. And then I think we can order it here if we wanted to <gasps> corn seeds. Do we want corn seeds? Corn seeds sound probably pretty good. Oh, and you can actually exchange it for uh 15 corn. will give you 10 scrap. Oh, there's like pissed vehicle parts too. That's kind of cool. <gasps> you can just buy a large planter box. Oh, wow. That is super. Okay. Hold on. So I want, um, uh, are these corn seeds? Let's get 80 corn seeds. So that's going to send a drone off. And you know what? Large planter box 30. I have, oh, and a delivery fee of 20. Ooh, let's buy, uh, we'll buy five of those. Oh, look at there's the drone. There it is. They're going to get the stuff. Where'd he go? That's so cool. Now I think I'm actually not even, I'm not positive. I actually think, um, if you are playing like multiplayer, I think you can actually shoot the drones down and get whatever they're like. So like if somebody was over here and they saw these drones flying by with a package on them, I think they can actually shoot them down and steal them. So that's super cool though. Oh, that's super cool. I want to see the drone come back. Oh, there it is right there. Oh, that is super cool. How do I get my items? <laughs> how do, how do I, how do I get them? Uh, open. <gasps> there they are. Oh my gosh. That is so cool. That is so cool. I love it. I love it so much. Okay. So, um, I guess let's go ahead and 
Let's go see if we can't get that little vehicle running. The little tiny van. Oh, it looks so cute. We'll go see if we can get it ready and we'll take it. We'll try to bring it back to uh, our base. All right, little minivan. <laughs> I got some goodies. Put you in there, you, and you. Acceleration, fuel economy, and top speed. Okay, so can I add anything else? Does anything... If I add this, does that fill that up? No, okay. And then we'll go ahead and mount. And it does not have lights, apparently. Um, where is the fuel? How do I put fuel in here? Oh, you know what? It's on the back. There we go. Oh my gosh. Can I do this in the vehicle? Um, you know what? We're gonna wait for uh, daylight because I can't see anything. It would be so cool if you could, uh, if we could put lights on it. <laughs> oh, look at that. This place has lights. Well, that's pretty cool. All right, well, I guess we'll wait till daytime. We'll take our van home. All right, let's roll. Hold on. We get the, the crates respawn. Oh my gosh, there's a mace. <laughs> I will take that. Uh, any other crates respawn? No, no, no. And oh, this one right here. What is this? Medium rechargeable battery. Oh, cool. All right, let's go see if we get some corn planted. All right, fuel storage. Putting those in there. Hop in. Oh my gosh. We're doing it. Oh, it says it's on E still. I don't know how much I don't know how much it takes to uh to actually like, you know, be able to go places with this, but we'll see how much fuel it takes to get back to our place. So we had 28 to start with. This is so cool. <laughs> I love it. Excuse me, Mr. Scientist. You're like literally in the middle of the road. You know, this little vehicle is perfect. I mean, we're just we're just cruising down the dirt roads with it. It's perfect. I love it so much. I wish there was like some storage in it, you know? Like we could take this around, go and loot all the things, grab a whole bunch of storage, but I wonder if that's like an upgrade option because I know there's like some vehicle building in this. All right, and oh, there's some hemp right there. I should come back and grab that. Looks like we're gonna be home sweet home. Oh my gosh, you know what I just realized? Forget the horses. I think we could park this up here. Oh! <gasps> we can oh look at that we got a garage <laughs> oh man that's amazing okay all right so let's get our planters looked at here so this is what i we needed to do oh oh these these will fit here perfectly all right so we'll put one there i like how these kind of snap so we'll do one two let's try to get one side done first oh let me get this one we'll do this one here oh you know what Maybe I should upgrade the foundations first. Then we'll set this one over here. Okay, that is super cool. So now, water, zero of 900 milliliters. Okay, so let's go ahead. Let me grab, um, let me grab my hammer so we can upgrade these walls a little bit. Let me grab the, maybe the chain. Ooh, oh yeah, how much fuel did we use? Uh, so we used 14 fuel on that that's not terrible let me grab the chainsaw let me grab some wood uh we need to get this greenhouse upgraded at least to wood oh and then i also have this guy uh so that way we're not utilizing like everything we also have another solar panel yeah we're, we're looking good on stuff and we're out of fuel man 14 fuel and chainsaw does not go very far whatsoever okay did we get everything upgraded hold on you you let's see we got these walls that foundation you know what i don't think i got the I don't think I got the foundations in the middle underneath these ones. Can I get these? Pretty sure those ones are not upgraded yet. Can I do it from the outside? Uh-oh. May have made a mistake. Actually, can we pick these up? Are these are these one of the things that we can actually pick up or no? Yeah, I can't get to those foundations. I don't know. Am I able to... I can't see. I was, I was also hoping that I could pick up this stuff. Some people said that if I press, just press and hold E. But it, it doesn't do anything. It doesn't let me... Like with the hammer that I could pick it up, but it won't let me. <gasps> what? How come it worked on that one? It definitely worked there. Um, okay, well, hold on a second. Because the reason, well, the reason I'm excited about that is because uh, I want to put this over here. So that way everything can be gravity fed. So I want to have that there, but I wanted to move this up. But I guess maybe we can't pick that one up. I guess I don't. Hmm. Okay, anyways, let's go ahead and let's get our wiring tool. Let's see if we can get um, some power to that. Oh, you know what? Do we need a switch? We probably are going to need a switch, right? Hold on. Let's see. Let's grab, um, where was it at? We have the wiring tool, the hose tool. We're going to need the, where was, what am I looking for here? We did have another splitter. 
thought we had another. Don't we have another solar? Oh, we have the solar. Okay, we already have the solar panel. <laughs> so if I wire this thing, how do we do, how do we do this? Output, input. Now can that only have one input? So if I grab say this, can we go from here to there? No, we cannot because it can only have one. Okay, never mind then. And then this one is output. Okay, so that's weird. So it's not a ground, it's an output. Okay, so we need to go from there into in. And then this guy, so we can make this look fancier. How do we connect you? There. Okay. Okay. <laughs> we're, we're, something's happening here. So now if I do, um, okay, so now we can do the host. Oh, you know what? We had the bigger battery. We had this huge one. Should we, should we wire this up to the solar panel? <laughs> that's a big power battery. Oh, that's a huge battery. 9,000 versus 150. That's terrible. Oh man. Can these run in series? Like if I grab this, can this one? No, that one cannot. Okay. That's really cool. I like how they have like all these different like power, power things. That's really neat. Um, all right. So now, uh, we need to play with the water. So the water thing now we got, unfortunately I should have put this up there. If I would have thought about it, I would have put it up there and then I could have gravity fed it down here and then that could have gravity fed down into a sprinkler. But you know, of course it doesn't work like that. Now, um, I need, what did I need? Um, oh, there was a, we had like a splitter thing. Uh, yes, this guy. So I wanted to get that guy to let's see where can we put this guy at i feel like we should just put it up here next to this for now we'll put that like that and then we'll get the hose tool and we'll go from here to there and then we'll go from this one to this okay so that's there now we can always i think we can always redo these later right can we can we always yeah i think we can always redo these later so if if you know we get start we start getting real serious about our greenhouses we can uh, redo the lines and make them look nicer and better but you know what it is what it is for now we're figuring things out okay so now how do i bring in select an appropriate container into your inventory or drag one using that okay so we need some kind of water storage deal um wasn't there a bucket actually what does it take to make the pump what is it? What a metal frags? Okay, hold on. We can make this because we actually have that whole other solar panel that we're not hooked up to anything. So we might as well just use that. Uh, and then we just need metal frags, which are currently located in here. We have a thousand metal frags. We need to get a furnace going. I know. I know we do. Um, but crafting this guy. Let's craft that. And then we'll hook up the, um, the, the other battery deal to that thing. Okay, so we got a fluid pump. So now, if I'm not mistaken... Can we put this on there? All right, so what I need to do is we need to go from output here to input, output, input, and I need the wiring deal, output, pump power, toggle, turn on. Oh, oh, I think it's going. Oh, <gasps> it's filling up. Now, is this sprinkler rating? <gasps> it is sprinkler rating. That's 28. Oh, that is 28. Okay, hold on. Uh, seeds. How do I plant? Oh my gosh. Okay, and then there's also, I'm going to tell you right now, there's also genetics associated with this, which I think is absolutely insane that it gets that deep, but hey, it does. Okay, that sprinkler actually worked in this. You know what? That sprinkler, if I put it in a corner right there, it would do four of them at once. It really would, without without a doubt. Now, this, the light, we probably... Light 100%, water 2%, ground 67, temperature overall is 2%. Okay, so what about, so, oh, the, we actually do need lights. But the light is 100% on this one and 100% on this one. So the light can go in the middle. Um, so we could put the, we could put the light and the sprinkler right here. And that would cover these two as well. Oh my gosh. Uh, do we have enough stuff to build another sprinkler and another light though? I think probably we do. All right, so we got another light and another sprinkler. Oh, this is so exciting. We're getting a greenhouse going. And it is so cool too. It's such a cool, like, I, I, I love it. I love it. All right, so let's get this guy like that. And then let's get our sprinkler uh, like that. So let's get our uh, plumbing, you know, let's get our wiring first. So we'll run this one to there and then we'll run it to there. Okay, so there's that. And then for plumbing, actually, is there a, is there an out on this one? Oh, pass through. Water in. Hey, 
I know you could pat. Okay, all right. This is super cool. I am so excited for this. Let's get our seeds planted now. <gasps> yes. Oh my gosh, it's so fantastic. Okay, so that's doing its thing. Now, how is this doing? So there's 3,300 in there. How's this thing doing? There's a thousand in there. So we probably need to get some timers or something hooked up to this because these are just gonna be like drained and emptied. This is so exciting. <laughs> Health is 10, age zero minutes, seed zero. Uh, water and take four milliliters per 60 seconds and then corn so basically we're just kind of waiting on this to get filled now we could put in some type of fertilizer oh my gosh we're growing corn this is so exciting <gasps> i love this i'm having so much fun with this this is so cool i'm just saying there's a lot of games out there that don't have this kind of stuff like especially this deep into the farming thing like you could get into making the perfect genetic corn uh that could be like this so look at that it's only one off uh, so, well, I think that's perfect. I don't know. I would say all green is all good, right? Um, so yeah, we have, <gasps> oh, look at that. We're growing corn. Now I'm hoping that everything is good and that it'll be good when we log back in because I typically only play like once a day. So, oh, but this is just so exciting. But yeah, that is going to end it. Thank you so much for coming out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did like subscribe, all the fun things. The next episode, we will hopefully have corn, sell corn maybe. And, uh, yeah, kind of go and do some other things. We also got our little vehicle, which is super cool. So. Yeah, all exciting things, all exciting things. But um, yeah, thank you again for coming out. Have a wonderful day. I will see you in the next one.